The Greek islands are a popular tourist destination for travelers who seek sun, sea, and culture. The islands offer a variety of attractions, from ancient ruins and museums to stunning beaches and picturesque villages. Whether you're looking for a relaxing getaway, an adventurous holiday, or a cultural immersion, you can find it in the Greek islands. Each island has its own charm and personality, as well as a rich history and heritage. The Greek islands are also known for their delicious cuisine, hospitable people, and lively festivals. You can taste the fresh seafood, olive oil, cheese, and wine, chat with locals, and learn about their traditions and customs. Sounds like your cup of tea? Keep watching to learn more about what Greek islands has to offer. Number 10. Idra. Idra is a small island in the Saronic Gulf, about 60 kilometers south of Athens. It is one of the most picturesque and charming destinations in Greece, with its whitewashed houses, narrow cobblestone streets, and colorful fishing boats. Idra has a rich history in culture, dating back to ancient times. It was a naval power in the 18th and 19th centuries, and a refuge for artists and intellectuals in the 20th century. Today, Idra attracts visitors who appreciate its natural beauty, tranquility, and authenticity. One of the most distinctive features of Idra is that it is a car-free island. The only modes of transportation are walking, donkeys, and water taxis. This makes Idra a perfect place to relax and enjoy the scenery without the noise and pollution of modern life. Idra has many attractions to offer, such as museums, monasteries, churches, and mansions. It also has a variety of beaches, from sandy to pebbly, where you can swim, sunbathe, or snorkel. Idra is also a paradise for hikers, as it has many trails that lead to stunning views of the sea and the mountains. Idra is an ideal destination for any season, as it has a mild Mediterranean climate. It is especially popular in the summer, when it hosts many cultural events and festivals, such as the Idra Festival of Arts and the Maiolia Festival. Idra is also a great base for exploring other nearby islands such as Spetses, Poros, and Aegina. Idra is easily accessible from Athens by ferry or hydrofoil, which take about 90 minutes to 2 hours. If you are looking for a unique and memorable vacation in Greece, Idra is the place to go. You will be enchanted by its beauty, charm, and atmosphere. Number 9. Milos Milos is one of the most beautiful islands in Greece, famous for its stunning landscapes, rich history, and diverse culture. Milos is located in the Aegean Sea, part of the Cyclades archipelago, and has a population of about 5,000 people. Milos is an ideal destination for tourists who want to experience the authentic Greek lifestyle enjoy the natural beauty, and explore the archaeological sites. Milos has a volcanic origin, which gives it a unique geology and morphology. The island has more than 70 beaches, each with its own character and charm. Some of the most popular beaches are Sarakiniko, a white lunar landscape sculpted by the wind and the waves, Firiplaka, a long sandy beach with turquoise waters and colorful rocks, and Tsigrado, a secluded cove accessible only by a rope ladder. Milos also has many caves, such as Papafragas, a natural pool surrounded by cliffs, and Kleftiko, a former pirate hideout with impressive rock formations. Milos has a rich history that dates back to the Neolithic era. The island was an important center of civilization in the ancient times and was the place where the famous statue of Venus de Milo was discovered in 1820. Milos has many archaeological sites and museums that showcase its heritage, such as the ancient theater, the catacombs, the Roman amphitheater, and the archaeological museum. Milos is a tourist destination that offers something for everyone. Whether you are looking for relaxation, adventure, culture, or history, Milos will not disappoint you.
Number 8. Zakynthos. Zakynthos, also known as Zante, is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Greece. Located in the Ionian Sea, it offers a variety of attractions and activities for visitors of all ages and preferences. Whether you're looking for a relaxing beach holiday, a cultural exploration, or an adventurous experience, Zakynthos has something for you. Some of the main attractions of Zakynthos are its stunning beaches, which are famous for their turquoise waters and white sand. Some of the most popular beaches are Navagio, also known as Shipwreck Beach, where you can see the remains of a smuggler ship that ran aground in 1980, Caracas, where you can watch the endangered loggerhead turtles lay their eggs, and Banana Beach, where you can enjoy water sports and beach bars. Zakynthos also has a rich history and culture, which you can discover by visiting its museums, churches, and monuments. Some of the highlights are the Byzantine Museum, which displays a collection of icons and paintings from the 15th to 17th centuries, the Church of Agios Dionysius, which houses the relics of the patron saint of the island, and the Venetian Castle, which offers panoramic views of the town and the sea. Number 7. Paros Paros is a beautiful island in the Aegean Sea, famous for its white marble, charming villages, and sandy beaches. It is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Greece, attracting visitors from all over the world who want to enjoy its natural beauty, rich culture, and vibrant nightlife. Paros offers something for everyone, whether you're looking for a relaxing holiday, a romantic getaway, an adventure, or a family vacation. You can explore the picturesque towns of Parikia and Naosa, where you can admire the traditional architecture visit the historical monuments and museums, and shop for local products and souvenirs. You can also discover the hidden gems of the island, such as the ancient marble quarries, the Byzantine churches, and the Venetian castles. Paros has a variety of beaches to suit every taste, from long stretches of golden sand to secluded coves and rocky shores. Number 6. Naxos. Naxos is the largest and most diverse island in the Cyclades, a group of islands in the Aegean Sea. It offers a variety of attractions for tourists, from stunning beaches and picturesque villages to ancient ruins and cultural festivals. Whether you are looking for a relaxing getaway or an adventurous exploration, Naxos has something for everyone. One of the main reasons to visit Naxos is its beautiful coastline, which stretches for over 90 kilometers. You can find sandy beaches, rocky coves, secluded bays, and crystal clear waters. Some of the most popular beaches are Agios Prokopios, Agia Ana, Plaka, and Mikri Vigla, where you can enjoy swimming, sunbathing, surfing, kite surfing, and other water sports. You can also take a boat trip to the nearby islands of Kofonisia, Iraklia, and Skinusa, which are part of the small Cyclades. Another reason to choose Naxos as your destination is its rich history and culture. Naxos was one of the first inhabited islands in Greece and has been influenced by various civilizations over the centuries. You can see the traces of this heritage in the archaeological sites, museums, and monuments that dot the island. Some of the most impressive ones are the Portara, a huge marble gate that was part of an unfinished temple dedicated to Apollo, the Venetian castle, a medieval fortress that houses a museum, a library, and a cultural center, and the Temple of Demeter, a 6th century BC sanctuary that was recently restored. Number 5. Corfu Corfu is one of the most popular and beautiful islands in Greece, attracting thousands of visitors every year. It is located in the Ionian Sea, off the northwest coast of mainland Greece, and has a rich history and culture that dates back to the ancient times. Corfu offers something for everyone. Whether you're looking for a relaxing beach holiday, a cultural exploration, or an adventurous outdoor activity, 
Some of the main attractions of Corfu include the Old Town. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is a charming and picturesque area that showcases the diverse influences of Corfu's past, such as Venetian, French, British, and Greek. You can wander through the narrow streets and alleys, admire the elegant architecture and monuments, visit the museums and churches, and enjoy the cafes and shops. Additionally, Corfu has over 200 kilometers of coastline, with many stunning beaches to choose from. You can find sandy or pebbly beaches, secluded or crowded beaches, organized or natural beaches, depending on your preference. Some of the most famous beaches are Pelio Castrizza, Sedari, Glifada, and Agios Gordios. Number 4. Rhodes. Rhodes is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Greece, and for good reasons. The island offers a rich history, stunning scenery, diverse culture, and plenty of activity for all ages and interests. Whether you are looking for a relaxing beach holiday, a cultural exploration, or an adventurous getaway, Rhodes has something for you. Some of the highlights of Rhodes include the medieval old town of Rhodes, a UNESCO World Heritage Site that preserves the legacy of the Knights of St. John who ruled the island from the 14th to the 16th century. You can walk along the cobblestone streets, admire the impressive fortifications, visit the Palace of the Grand Master, and enjoy the many museums, shops, and restaurants. The Acropolis of Lindos, a spectacular ancient site that overlooks the picturesque village and Bay of Lindos. You can climb up to the ruins of the Temple of Athena Lindia, dating back to the 4th century BC, and marvel at the views of the Aegean Sea and the Valley of the Butterflies, a natural reserve that hosts thousands of colorful butterflies every summer. You can follow the trails along the river, admire the lush vegetation, and observe the butterflies in their natural habitat. Number 3. Mykonos Mykonos is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Greece, attracting visitors from all over the world who want to enjoy its stunning beaches, vibrant nightlife, and rich culture. Mykonos is part of the Cyclades Islands, located in the Aegean Sea, and has a history that dates back to the ancient times. The island is famous for its whitewashed houses, blue dome churches, and windmills that dot the landscape. Mykonos also offers a variety of activities and attractions for tourists, such as museums, art galleries, archaeological sites, and festivals. Some of the most notable places to visit in Mykonos are the Little Venice, a picturesque neighborhood with colorful houses and balconies overlooking the sea, the Panagia Paraportiani, a complex of five churches that form one of the most photographed landmarks of the island, and the Delos Island, a UNESCO World Heritage Site that was once a sacred sanctuary and the mythical birthplace of Apollo and Artemis. Whether you are looking for a relaxing getaway or an adventurous holiday, Mykonos has something for everyone. You can sunbathe on the golden sands of Paradise Beach, party at the famous clubs and bars of Cora, or explore the traditional villages and scenic trails of the island. Number 2. Crete Crete is the largest and most populous of the Greek islands, and a popular tourist destination for its rich cultural heritage, diverse natural beauty, and hospitable people. Whether you're looking for ancient ruins, pristine beaches, scenic mountains, or lively cities, Crete has something to offer for everyone. Crete is the birthplace of the Minoan civilization, one of the oldest and most advanced in Europe, you can explore the impressive palaces of Knossos, Vaistos, and Malia, and marvel at the frescoes, pottery, and jewelry that showcase the artistic and technological achievements of the Minoans. You can also visit the archaeological museums of Heracleion and Cania, where you can see artifacts from different periods of Cretan history, from the Neolithic to the Roman times. Crete is also home to many Byzantine churches, Venetian fortresses, Ottoman mosques, 
and traditional villages that reflect the diverse influences that shape the island's culture. Crete is blessed with a varied landscape that ranges from snow-capped mountains to sandy beaches, from fertile plains to rugged gorges. You can hike the famous Samaria Gorge, the longest in Europe, and enjoy the stunning views of the cliffs, forests, and rivers along the way. You can also explore the caves of Dictyon and Idion, where according to Greek mythology, Zeus was born and raised. If you love water sports, you can swim, snorkel, surf, or kayak in the crystal clear waters of the Mediterranean Sea, or join a boat tour to visit the nearby islands of Spinalonga, Gramvusa, or Krissi. Number 1. Santorini Santorini is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Greece, and for good reasons, the island offers stunning views of the Aegean Sea, picturesque villages, ancient ruins, and volcanic landscapes. Santorini is also famous for its sunsets, which paint the sky and the whitewashed buildings in vibrant colors. Whether you're looking for a romantic getaway, a cultural experience, or an adventure, Santorini has something for everyone. Some of the main attractions of Santorini include the caldera. The caldera is the crater formed by a massive volcanic eruption that occurred around 1600 BC. The eruption destroyed most of the island and created a lagoon surrounded by steep cliffs. The caldera is now filled with water and dotted with smaller islands, such as Tirasia and Nea Kamena. You can take a boat tour to explore the caldera and see the active volcano, the hot springs, and the rock formations. There's also Fira, the capital and the largest town of Santorini, and is located on the edge of the caldera and offers spectacular views of the sea and the volcano. Fira is also a lively place with many shops, restaurants, bars, and museums. You can walk along the narrow streets and admire the traditional architecture, or take a cable car or a donkey ride to reach the old port below. Oia is another picturesque town on the northern tip of Santorini. It is famous for its blue dome churches, cave houses, and windmills. Oya is also the best place to watch the sunset in Santorini, as it offers a panoramic view of the caldera and the sea. You can find many art galleries, boutiques, cafes, and taverns in Oya, as well as some luxury hotels and villas. If you are planning to visit Greece, make sure to include Santorini in your itinerary. You will not regret it.